Hello everyone, my name is Sandeep Singh Gupta and you are watching Electric Vehicles. So in this video, let's do a comparison between Aether's 450X Generation 3 and Simple's 1 scooter. Now both these scooters from a distance, they look the same. They have the same design language, the same design element going for them. The specifications for both these scooters are available and also our Hyderabad team has already done the first ride review of both these scooters. If you have not watched that, the links will be in the description. So based on all of this, we are making this video so that it is easier for you to decide which one to book. Now the most important part of an electric scooter is of course the range. For simple one, it is 236 kilometers of ARAI range, but the company says that you should be able to extract 200 kilometers of real range. If you want to buy an extended battery, that is available and that gives you a range of 300 kilometers. For Aether 450X, the ARAI range is 145 kilometers, but the true range is 105 kilometers. Now the difference comes because of the battery capacity. Now the simple one comes with a battery capacity of 4.8 kilowatt hour lithium ion. If you extend it, you get a battery capacity of 6.3 kilowatt hour. For Aether 450X, the battery capacity is 3.7 kilowatt hour and usable is 3.2 kilowatt hour. Now speaking of motor performance, both these scooters, they come with a PMSM bell driven motor, but the capacity of simple one's motor is much larger than what Aether 450X generation three comes with. The simple one comes with a motor capacity of 4.5 kilowatt that is able to generate a peak power of 8.5 kilowatt. For Aether 450X generation three, it is 3.3 kilowatt, which is able to deliver a peak power of 6.4 kilowatt. Now, because of this powerful motor, simple one is able to achieve much better performance. The zero to 40 kilometers per hour in case of simple one is a mere 2.7 seconds. In case of Aether 450X generation three, it is 3.3 seconds. Now the top speed, for simple one is at 105 kilometers per hour. In case of generation three 450X, it is 85 kilometers per hour. But the striking difference comes in case of torque. The torque for simple one is three times than what the generation three is able to achieve. 72 Newton meters of torque is what the simple one gives you. For 450X generation three, it is a mere 26 Newton meters. Now, other than that, there are specifications which are similar for both these scooters. First of all, the seat height. The simple one comes with a seat height of 775 mm. For 450X generation three, it is 780 mm. What about the suspension? Yes, they are also same. Both these scooters come with a front telescopic suspension and they have monoshock suspension in the rear. The braking system is also similar for both of them. They both come with a combi braking system with disc brakes, both in the front and in the rear. Speaking of tire size, they are also similar. They both come with a 12 inch tires and both the scooters come with the same amount of weight. It is 115 kgs for simple one and 112 kgs for 450X generation three. If you want to book the scooters today, 450X should be available next month and of course simple one is also claiming that they'll start the deliveries at least the test rides from September onwards for the general public. Now the warranty for both these scooters are also similar three years the difference comes in the price. Now although the simple one has a bigger battery pack and therefore a better range it has a much powerful motor and therefore better performance the simple one is still much cheaper as compared to the 450X. If you take the base variant where you don't get the extended uh, range, which is uh, you're getting a range of 200 kilometers. In that case, the price for simple one is 1 lakh 10,000 rupees. If you get the additional battery pack for the extended range of uh, up to 300 kilometers, then the price goes up to 1 lakh 45,000. In case of Aether 450X though, generation three, it is at 1 lakh 55,000 rupees markedly higher than the simple one, although it is providing a much lesser performance uh, in comparison. But then Aether has a uh, trust that it has built up. It is an established product in the market. And probably that is why few people, at least my question to you, would you be willing to pay this extra premium for the brand value or the brand trust that Aether generates? Or would you rather go with the simple one? Please let us know your opinion in the comment section and we'll meet again with one such more video. Go green, go electric.